So the European Breeders Fund Handicap Hurdle is next then, and this is a two mile five furlong race. And the top one is Super Bad Kevin Minahan, Musty Mutt, Stu Gray, All the Time Martin Little, Martin to Music, Stu Gray, Crucifix Jamie Hopkins, and Ram Jamie Hopkins. So away they go then, and a small field and a couple of trainers doubly represented. So this must have been a race that quite a lot of people didn't like the look of. And Musty Mutt has gone into the lead from Ram with super bad and martin's music next and then crucifix and all the time the back marker so over the first flight they go just four trainers represented in this then Stu gray got the first two at the moment musty mutt and martin's music and then jamie hopkins has got ram and crucifix and kevin minahan has got super bad and kevin minahan has already had a good start to the day at ludlow as they take the next all the time is the back marker trained by somewhere but nobody's ever heard of and musty mutt is the leader then from ram in second crucifix in third and then martin's music is fourth it's super bad after that one and all the time is just the back marker at this stage they're coming out of the two mile mark then they've skipped over the third flight of hurdles and musty mutt has opened up by about four or five lengths to ram in second and super bad in third then martin's music is fourth Crucifix is fifth and all the time seems to want to spend all the time in last place at this moment in time. So Musty Mutt then through the rain takes us down towards the next with a commanding lead at this stage over Ram in second. And Martin's music is third, all the time has now moved up into fourth, then super bad and crucifix is just the back marker now. So a long way to go. That's some strange races this season, that was they take the fourth and some huge fields in some races and then we've had quite a few races where we've only had like seven or eight or five or six which is, um, makes things interesting as they skip over that one and with only six in this race five should pick up prize money if they all get round which just means one unlucky trainer but again maybe not because two trainers have got two so there are only four trainers in this so maybe everybody will get a little bit of cash to waste at Royal Ascot next week and Musty Mutt is in the lead from Ram in second Martin's music is third and then all the time is fourth super bad and crucifix are the back two what it is then skips over the seventh all safely over that one as well uh, week four very nearly in the book then and next week is your last week really for having a look what your horses are doing and seeing if you're going to take them out and bring new ones in I'm not sure if there's a week off this season on a feeling we don't get a week off i think it just goes straight from week five to week six so that transfer window and the entries as they skip over number eight will all have to be done in the space of a few days so it's going to be a busy time and musty much the leader crucifix is second martin's music is third and then super bad is four ram is fifth and all the time he's back in last place again as they begin to make their way towards the business end of this race and they skip over the ninth and musty mutt now being challenged by his stable companion martin's music on the outside then comes super bad crucifix and ram and all the time is just the tail end charlie at this point but it's martin's music and musty mutt the two stable companions train on the beach together in spain and away they go over that one with super bad chasing them in third then comes crucifix and ram their stable companions running together as well all the time being switched to the outside but it's musty mutt and martin's music then continuing to show the way to ram and super bad crucifix and all the time look like they might be beginning to struggle and now musty mutt kicks on and leads by a couple of lengths to martin's music in second super buddy's trying to throw down a challenge in third then comes ram and crucifix all the time is after that one but musty mutt has got them thinking about this as he comes down towards the next flight of hurdles it's musty mutt in the lead with just a little more than two furlongs still in a race that's the third from home and musty mutt lands in the lead super bad is second martin's music is in third it's two stew grades against one kevin Meenan. where have the rest gone it's musty mutt in the lead from super bad over the second last they go and it's still musty mutt in 
in the lead from Superbad in second. Martin's Music in third. It's Musty Mutt. Musty Mutt lands in the lead. Here comes Superbad on the outside. Superbad now in a ding dong battle with Musty Mutt. Musty Mutt and Superbad as they race up towards the line. And Musty Mutt looks like he's got enough in hand. And Musty Mutt has won it. And is that the first jump winner of the season for Stu Gray? If it is, it'll stop him moaning, and that'll be something for us all to rejoice about. Goodness me. Musty Mutt takes it for Stu Gray. Kevin Meenahan second with Superbad. Martin's Music third for Stu Gray. And Crucifix fourth for Jamie Hopkins. All the time for Madeline was fifth. And Ram was the last one to finish.